on your face you don't touch this applicator for this week using those soap is that it melts really really fast your face will continue to look darker than the rest of the world hello guys welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel so in today's video i'm going to be sharing with you guys my morning skincare routine and i'm going to be showing you everything i use on my skin both in the shower and out of the shower so today i also exfoliated my body and i'm going to be showing you guys the body scrub that i use to exfoliate my body so the body scrub i use today is the booster white spa so this is a scrub i recently started using okay not too recently because i've been using it since like last year but it's really really good because i like how it looks and the feel on your skin is just really really nice so this particular scrub i got it for 2500 or so the last time i went to the market but it is really really nice and the container is so large this one it has gone like almost half but um yeah i really recommend this and i use this today in the shower and i also um got a good not like i use a face scrub but when i got to the market i ended up like really liking this face scrub so i decided to just try it out this is the beauty formulas brightening vitamin c micro polishing facial scrub and like this is the first time i'm actually trying this scrub and i'm really really liking it it is so mild on the skin like oh my god i really like it so step one is cleanse you want to make sure that you've cleansed your skin and by cleansing i mean that you just clean your skin wash your face to get rid of any dirt on oil on your face okay that's just what i mean by cleansing i started off by cleansing in the shower with my dove body soap like are you guys know i actually just use the same body soap on my face and on my body so a great tip that i've learned because dove is really really moisturizing but one thing i've learned with using dove soap is that it melts really really fast like if you have a dove bar of soap and you have another soap the dove bar tends to finish faster i don't know if you use dove soap you can let me know in the comments but since i started using dove bar i noticed that it melts a little bit faster especially if you leave it in like a moist environment so what i do is that when i get my dove bar soap just to like ensure that it lasts as long as it should i just cut it into half like i keep half of it just to like make sure that it doesn't waste away in the shower because a lot of times when you're showering you tend to like pour water on your soap and all that so i found that if you cut half of your bar and keep it even if the other half finishes in like two weeks and you use this for another two weeks that's like in months and it really really lasts and this soap it's not too expensive i'm just um it's just a great hack that i've found to like ensure that my products are used as effectively as they should and i believe that in one of my videos i've already mentioned the body cream that i use this is the scent ives smoothing rose and argan oil this is the pink um scent ives i really really like scent ives because all of their products are very moisturizing and it doesn't leave your skin dry so if you have any sort of like dry skin issue i highly recommend that you give um this scent ives lotion a good try so the next step in this um skincare routine after cleansing is the toning this i make use of my make use of my Parma yeah. skin success deep cleansing astringent i've talked about this um astringent a lot this toner is really really nice and i've used it since way before i was struggling with acne it is so so good for acne prone skin if you have acne or you're dealing with breakouts i recommend that you get this it is really good for like stopping the well i say the acne in your face before it even comes out that's just the best way to describe it but yeah this one is really nice i got this for around four thousand naira also i don't know if it has increased around but since i've been using it it's been about three thousand to like 4k but this is this is the way it looks and it is really really nice i recommend this if you're having an um if you're having acne and all the rest because it contains salicylic acid and salicylic acid is very good for acne okay if you're having breakouts it is really good for acne and any of those so if case you don't want to use um a toner that has salicylic acid or you don't have acne maybe your skin is normal you can actually also make use of this eden rose water and glycerin eden rose water and glycerin is another toner that i highly recommend because it's it's very much moisturizing and if um if you don't have acne your skin is just normal i say um, i would recommend this because it's affordable it's like 2500 or so it's no more than 2k or 25 so i said that um i recommend that this one you get this one and try it out because if this one is for acne but this one is for normal skin the first well. step i'm going to be taking now is to take my toner to use this you just want to grab your toner 
and then you just want to make sure you have like a cotton pad or cotton wool like this is my cotton wool right now i'm just going to be using this to clean my face with the toner okay so just going to be opening that and then just pour a little bit pour a little bit and then use that on your face just use that all around your face and what i really like about it is that it has this like minty when i say fragrance that on your face it just like gives you that cooling effect i really like it and if you're having acne this is really good because the salicylic acid in it kills the acne that you're having from inside so um i'm just going to be applying that all over my face and this thing it gets rid of deaths from your skin if your skin is like not properly cleansed in the shower this will get rid of any extra day that is still on your skin so that's what I'm saying. So guys, this is the face that I washed in the shower. Look at all the death that is still coming out because I used the cleanser. So one thing I like about using cleanser, I'm um, sorry, toner is that after using a toner it really gets rid of any extra death that is left on your face and this astringent is really good for that the next step after um the toner and cleansing that's if you're a beginner the steps are cleansing toner then is a facial serum you can use any facial serum that you have vitamin c serum hydraulic acid serum niacinamide but today the serum that i'm actually using is the niacinamide serum so this is my facial serum and I'm going to be making use of it. I've talked about this serum a lot. If you're having breakouts, if you're having acne, give this serum a try. Honestly, you will not regret it. Because it has this niacinamide and zinc, this combination really deals with acne very, very well. And it's really good for sensitive skin. If you're having a lot of like breakouts and your skin is extra sensitive, I recommend this. Try this out. It's actually affordable because I get it online on Jumia. I buy it from Jumia at like 3K. To like three five it's no more than that check it out on junior i think i can put a link to where i get it from in my description box so you guys can check it out so anyway i'm just going to be applying my serum one tip i want to give about using this serum is that ensure that you don't this um applicator ensure that you don't um touch it to your skin because kind of makes it or like say you transfer germs from your face to the bottle so if you want to make sure that it is as clean as you can get it to be just make sure that whenever you're applying it on your face you don't touch this applicator to your skin that's really important so i'm just going to um dab that in and like rub it in properly and whatever you are doing ensure that you also rub your toner on your neck because it is really really important for me i used to have chest acne a lot so it really helps me and if you're using like this serums, ensure that you also have a good sunscreen because that's like part of the steps I use in my morning skincare routine. But yeah, lately I've had some breakouts that left me really, like some acne, like say spots on my face. But I'm working on them because in my night skin time routine, which I'm going to be showing you guys as well, you know, in this video, I use this night face cream that is really, really good for removing spots and i still make use of my my homemade mask for spots my turmeric and honey mask i think i said i mentioned this in a previous video also one of my skincare videos i've talked about my turmeric and honey mask for dark spots and acne so yeah so guys the next step is to apply your facial moisturizer or your face cream i don't use my body cream on my face because that's just um it's not good for face but I use it as my body cream and I have a separate cream I use as my face cream so even if you have oily skin I believe that you should still use a facial moisturizer it is important I won't be going into details in this video because this video is already getting long as it is but yeah and um, this is the facial cream that I use it's actually almost finished It's the pure max pure no max face cream pure no max face cream I've shown away the packet I can't remember where I dropped it for the life of me but this cream is about 1500 you don't have to use this facial cream the point of this video is actually just to show you the steps that you use in applying your morning skincare products okay so this is the next step the fourth step is applying a good face moisturizer 
or your face cream so this is my face cream and i'm actually almost finished look at it like this the tiny nothing inside if i'm going to manage it so i'm just going to be applying that on my face because this is very very moisturizing and it's good for my skin so i'm just going to be applying that all over my skin just like work it in don't forget your size your facial the size of your face like because i see that a lot of people just focus on this area that people can see whenever you're applying make sure you go right to the sides of your skin and apply as well now that we've applied our face cream the next step is your sunscreen if you are going out i don't recommend heading out of your house without a sunscreen honestly it is will well, let's say draw your skincare routine backwards it is just going to draw your skincare routine backwards please 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 if you um if you go out a lot in the sun or you have any dealing outside during the day please ensure that you get a good sunscreen for me i use this bevier uv sunscreen this is the sunscreen that i use this sunscreen is really really good and i love the way it feels on my skin but you don't have to use this one there's the simple sunscreen there is dr rachel sunscreen there are many many sunscreens that you can get that are really affordable for me this one cost me about 2500 also because most of my products i actually order online so they include my shipping fee with the amount of the product so it's not exactly the same amount all the time you get but this is the um the sunscreen that i use i really really recommend this if you have if you have a good sunscreen that you're using you can go ahead but this one is also little really things nice. cause i got big deals and i got little like things that. got everything asking for but you stop taking a big deal out of the little thing let's get so, carried away come right now you know where i stand I applied your sunscreen you are free to head outside because honestly without sunscreen the sun will just be coming directly to your face and your face will continue to look darker than the rest of your body it is essential that you use sunscreen if you want your body and your face your face and your body to be properly toned i've come to the end of this today's video because my skincare morning skincare is actually all of these are really very simple and affordable okay especially for beginners it's a simple step cleanse tone um serum face cream and then sunscreen five simple steps and you have it there thank you so much for watching this video to this point if you are here please give this video a thumbs up guys it really helps me give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel i don't know what you guys are waiting for if you've been watching a few of my videos please please consider subscribing to my channel because it really really helps me a lot and it supports my channel okay so give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel to see more videos like this and until the next video bye